And off the top at 6 o'clock tonight, a big development late this afternoon in the race for governor. There will be a debate between the top two candidates. Political reporter Rick Albin at the live desk now with a look at what this means. Rick. Well, what it means is that Republican Rick Snyder was able to dictate the terms of this debate to Democrat Verge Bonero. It means that Snyder is taking the issue off the table. He'll no longer be hounded by reporters or Bonero about why he won't debate. And it also means that he has limited his exposure to the feisty Bonero to just one meeting on public television on the east side of the state. As for Bonero, he'll do it, even if he doesn't like it much. Late today, he was still willing to accept an offer that was on the deal a couple of weeks ago, uh, a deal that was on the table, I should say, a couple of weeks ago. But apparently Snyder was not willing to offer that again. For him to arbitrarily pull that offer off the table of three debates, uh, there's just no excuse for it. There's no excuse for it. He, he sat there and had a stubborn, he was just stubbornly dug in on one debate. One debate. He gave no rationale. He gave no reason. But one debate is what he was offering. And, you know, I accepted the one debate uh, very, in a very, you know, being very disappointed. But the public deserves uh, more. But one debate is better than none. And the issue was time. And the absentee ballots are going out now. We've been very consistent since day one. And October 10th is at the back end of that over what we originally you know, would have proposed or preferred because people would have voted by then. So I think we came to a good agreement, and we're just going to move forward, and let's do a debate. That lone meeting will take place October 7th in Detroit on public television with two Detroit area newspaper people serving as moderators. It will be seen here in West Michigan, but for right now, it is a completely east side production with no input from West Michigan whatsoever. Live at the Live Desk, Rick Albin, back to you.